How is bread made? Bread is a very important food. Millions of people around the world eat it every day. And amazingly, the basic recipe for bread has been the same for thousands of years. You just mix flour and water to make dough and then bake. To make a loaf of wholemeal bread like this one, it's a bit more complicated. Soft breads like this have an added ingredient, yeast. This works inside the dough to make it rise, and so when it's baked, it's much softer. In this factory, they make thousands of loaves like this every single hour. The first job is to weigh out all the ingredients – flour, yeast, salt, water, and very small quantities of some other ingredients, like fat and vitamin C. Next, this machine mixes all of the ingredients together to become stretchy and gooey dough. Then, they divide up the dough into loaf-sized amounts. Shape it. And put it into tins. Now it's time to let the yeast do its work and make the dough rise. They put the dough in a warm, damp place. This is called proving. Did you know that yeast is a kind of fungus, like a mushroom? But yeast fungi are microscopic. That means they are so small, you need a microscope to see them. Once the loaves have risen, they are baked in these big ovens. They have to get the temperature just right. These ovens bake the bread at 230 degrees Celsius for 22 minutes. They blow the air around the tins to evenly bake the loaf. When they are ready, the loaves are removed from their tins and left to cool for two hours. Bread, bread, crusty bread, bake it in the oven, the baker said. Bread, bread, now they are ready for slicing. This machine does the slicing job. And then the bread is put into bags. Finally, the freshly baked loaves are packed up in these lorries and taken to shops all around the country, ready for you to eat and enjoy.